Hi, I'm Pete from RS, and in this video, we're going to take a look at the GERTBOT. The GERTBOT is a motor control board made especially for the Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi has GPIO pins that allow you to experiment with physical computing. These are fine for low power applications, but with most pins at 3.3 volt, you can only provide a maximum of a 50 milliamp draw. So, for applications that require more power, such as driving motors, some additional hardware is needed. The GERTBOT is a great solution for this. It plugs directly into the Pi's GPIO header and is controlled via the GERTBOT software. This is easily downloaded and installed onto your Raspberry Pi. This allows users to control and drive a variety of stepper and brush motors. The GERTBOT can also be used as a standalone board and can be controlled by any computer via a UART serial port. With four H bridges on board, the GERTBOT can drive up to four DC motors up to 30 volt at 2.5 amp or two stepper motors. There is the option of cascading up to four GERTBOTs per Pi, giving more outputs as required. Additional GPIO includes two DACs, four ADCs, and two open drain outputs. This means, for example, you can connect analog devices like potentiometers, force sensitive resistors, and moving coil meters to your Pi 2. Also on board is a 64 MHz Cortex M3 ARM microcontroller that comes pre programmed with its own firmware. This takes care of the signal timing and PWM generation, meaning the Pi does not have to be running a specialist real-time kernel or operating system. For peace of mind, there's also a thermal and short circuit protection, as well as pre-configured safeguards such as emergency stop and system halt upon motor failure. This all runs on the ARM microcontroller and can be called at high level commands from the Pi at any time. So the GERTBOT is easy to set up, includes high-level commands making it easy to control, it has the capacity to plug in up to four more boards, and has outputs that are short-circuited and thermal protected. It also can be controlled without programming. All in all, it's a great solution for experimenting with motors.